Hey guys, it's me again, and uh, today I uh, thought I had to get something out to you. I, I've been pretty busy with school and whatnot, so I haven't really been able to do too much when it comes to recording. I've had a lot of homework to do, stuff like that. This is just what I do in my couple hours of spare time in the day. Sadly, I haven't been able to get things uploaded or recorded. Alright, so now, what I've made here is a tic tac toe. Uh, game out of redstone and pistons. So uh, first I'll show you how it works here. So if you hit uh, blah, 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 center one, it'll go pop an X up on the center. Now this is X's control panel, O's is over there. And uh, I have implemented turns, so basically you can't go again until O goes. Alright, now go over here, B O and O shall pop up there. Now, another thing I've implemented when it comes to logic, I've made, oh, no, oh, actually, you know what? Since it switched the turns, I'm gonna have to do something else anyways. Okay, there, okay, so now back to O. You can't, uh, oh, if you try and cover up someone's character, it pretty much forfeits your turn and their character gets to stay. No turn for you. Because <laughs> basically what happens is I didn't mean to actually make it so it forfeits your turn, but I made it so that you can't overlap somebody's uh, thing. I used a logic gate to make it so that once an X is there, it stays there. Nothing can overlap it. So, But I didn't think about it, uh, it over, uh, giving up your turn. But whatever. It's not too big an issue. Just don't overlap other people's. So yeah. Um, the control panel just is annoying because all the wiring that has to go down and then because these are nine inputs that have to go all the way over here to the back and then plug it into the RS Norlatch system and then the logic gate that I made and then into the two segment display at the back so yeah and then once the game is over I have yet to implement winning detection but I probably will at some point and then just back here in the room there's a little reset button and it clears the board so yeah. that's just a little something I've been working on lately I hope you guys enjoyed this uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys later probably hopefully